Yes, good morning children. Before we start with today's class, let me ask you a few questions. Okay? Tell me, what is the name of our planet? Yes, Prachi? Earth. Earth. Very good. We live on planet Earth. And how much time does it take to complete one rotation? Yes, Arna? 24 hours. 24 hours to complete one rotation. Right? On what does it rotate itself? Who will tell me that? Yes, Ranvi? Uh, axis. Axis. Very good. Earth rotates itself on its axis. Now, how is the axis of our planet Earth? Yes, love? Inclined. It is inclined, right? It is inclined. Now, what is this? What you all can see this? This is a geek. Globe. This is a globe. Very good. We can observe here that the axis of our earth, see it is rotating, right? But it is inclined, right? On this globe, we can see so many lines running from east to west and from north to south. So today we are going to learn about these lines. What are they called and how are they useful to us? So let us start with the video. Latitudes and longitudes. Our topic name for today is Latitudes and Longitudes. Just like a letter is able to reach your house to your address, a specific place on the map or on the globe can be located with the help of geographic coordinate system. The geographic coordinates of a place consist of the degrees of latitude and longitude. Yes. So we can locate any place on this globe on by the help of this latitudes and longitudes. Okay. Now let us see how many latitudes are there, how many longitudes are there and how we can locate a place. A locate a place. Wait. Latitudes or parallels are imaginary lines drawn parallel to the equator to yes. Now what are latitudes? Latitudes are parallel lines which are drawn from east to west. Each line when you see they are parallel to each other they will never intersect each other. Right? So they are parallel to each other. Are they real lines drawn on our earth? No. no. They are imaginary lines. Right? And this green line which you can see what is this? This is an equator. This is equator. Which divides our earth into two hemispheres. That is northern hemisphere and southern hemisphere. Towards both the north and south directions. They are measured from 0 degree to 90 degrees in both hemispheres. So yes, we have latitudes from 0 degree to 90 degrees in both the hemispheres. So 90 degrees for your northern hemisphere and 90 degrees for southern hemisphere. So total we have how many latitudes? 90 plus 90 and 1 equator. So it is 181 latitudes in all we have at 1 degree each. The earth is round. And so, the length of the latitudes decreases as we move towards the poles. Longitudes or meridians are the imaginary line. Yes. Now, what are longitudes? Longitudes are the meridians drawn from <laughs> north pole to south pole. Okay. What is the shape of the meridian here you can see? The shape of the meridian is semicircular. Right? They are, they meet at poles, north pole to south pole. Means drawn between the two poles. They divide the earth in 360 equal segments. So how many longitudes we have? 360. Right? At 1 degree each we can draw 360 meridians. Like that of an orange. The zero degree longitude passing through Greenwich in England is called the prime meridian. Yes. As we have equator which divides our earth into northern and southern hemisphere, we have a zero degree meridian which is called prime meridian. A 
okay it is dividing our earth into two hemispheres that is eastern hemisphere and western yes. hemisphere and it passes through greenwich which is located in england right yes arya come and show me where is equator Oh, 